What's up, you nerdy nerds on YouTube? My name is Kevin, and I'm a nerd just like you. So, before we start this video, if you haven't seen my review of the Power Rangers movie Mastodon Zord with the 5-inch figure, I will leave a direct link in the description, if I can. Um, so, now that we have business out of the way, now we can move forward to the Power Rangers movie Sabretooth Tiger Zord and the 5-inch figure. So, as, for, as always, we will take a look at the 5-inch figure first. This is the female mold of the 5-inch figure line. As you can see, she's primarily yellow with blue and silver highlights. You can see more of the molding on the figure than the Black Ranger figure. But if you take a look at the yellow figure, you can actually see more of the molding. Especially in the back. So, I, I like the 5 inch figures. I really do. Um, but the female figures are a little off to me. I don't know if it's because of the skinniness of the arms and the legs. Because um, if you look at the male mold, I mean, they're not buffed out and like muscled as the normal uh, five inch figures. I, I don't know, I just think they're way too skinny. Um, she does come with one accessory, this little flamey piece. You can attach it to her wrist, arm, or her, you, you can attach it, you can attach it to her hands by using this little joint right here. It doesn't stay very well on her as the uh, the metal figures so uh trainee has very limited articulation um she can move her arms 360 she has elbow joints her arms can't or her hands can't move she can move her head 360 she can do the splits. Uh, she has knee articulation, no foot articulation. That's pretty much all I have to say about this five inch figure. So we will move on to the Megazord itself. Here we have the Sabretooth Tiger Zord. Um, it has four legs. Uh, it looks a little bit more alien. I know that's what they were going for. With this movie, the Sabretooth Tiger has a gimmick. You press this button, it's kind of like a little gun thing. Uh, also comes with a mini ranger, and to get her in her cockpit, um, it isn't in the mouth like pretty much all the other ones. Uh, you have to take the gun off, and hers is right back here on the back. And she just lops her like so, and there you go. Um, there isn't really any articulation to this figure whatsoever. Um, because it is the torso of the Megazord. To get it into the Megazord form, you just take this gun off, plop it up like this, to where the feet are facing, that way. You fold the legs sideways, and spin the head. That's it. She is now ready to 
combined with all the other pieces of the Megazord. Are you guys planning on seeing the movie this weekend? I know I am. I'm pretty excited. Um, so, there you guys have it. There is my review of the Sabertooth Tiger movie Megazord with the movie 5-inch figure. I hope you guys have liked this video. Please subscribe and give me a like. If you guys have any questions, leave them down in the comment section below and I will answer it for you. And if you haven't seen any of my videos, I have every single video in a playlist that is specific to this item. Like I do Pops, Pokemon, and Power Rangers. So I will guys see you in my next video where I do where I review another Power Rangers movie Megazord piece. And I will see you in my next video. And remember, stay nerdy, my friends. Peace.